What's up guys, welcome to Apex, thanks for tuning in. Here we have got the brand new Samsung Galaxy Watch 6 Classic LTE variant. And in this video, you're gonna see how to activate the LTE services on this watch. Now all this while I've been using the uh, Bluetooth variant because I always felt that the LTE variant is gonna consume a lot of battery and uh, battery is something really important for me. So I have always been using the uh, Bluetooth version. My previous watch was the Galaxy Watch 5 Pro and this watch has been offering at least three to four days of battery life easily. Uh, and this is the Bluetooth variant that I have. And this is the first time I'm trying uh, the LTE variant. This is the classic uh, Watch 6 LTE. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, check out how exactly we can connect it. Uh, now, I have already paired uh, the phone with the watch or the watch with the phone. Uh, and while pairing it, uh, we will be prompted to enable the LTE services as well. Now, if you have skipped it like I did, what you can do is you can open the variable application. Now here the Watch 6 Classic is connected. Let me tap on Watch Settings. Now, uh, in the Watch Settings, we will be able to see an option called mobile plans. As you can see, if it is an LTE variant, you will be able to see this option. If it is a Bluetooth variant, you do not get to see this option here. Now it says mobile plans, add, manage, or remove mobile plans here. Now, like I said, I'm doing this for the first time. Let's go ahead and do this. I'll tap on mobile plans. Uh, it says set up a mobile plan to call, text, and go online from your watch when your phone's not with you. To start setting up a mobile network for your watch device information, example IMEI, SIM card info, model name of your mobile device, and a watch will be transmitted to the mobile network operator. Please read your mobile network operator's privacy policy carefully regarding how your data is processed. Now let me just tap on next. Now it says connecting to your service provider. Uh, I have got the Airtel services here in India on this particular phone. Here it says, good news with breakthrough eSIM technology. You can now use the same Airtel postpaid plan on your Samsung watch. So here in my region, uh, the, the services are not chargeable for the uh, eSIM on the watch. Uh, I'm sure in the US and in Europe, uh, probably you'll have to uh, pay some additional uh, charges to activate the eSIM on the watch. Uh, the best part is here in my region in India, I can just directly activate this. Now here we have got an option to activate services. I'll tap on this. It says set up a mobile plan, finding out more, set up your Airtel plan on your watch. It is asking me, I will tap on use plan. And I just got a message which says, Congratulations, the smartwatch has been successfully paired with your smartphone having Airtel number so and so. I just go back now. As you can see, it is setting up the mobile plan. Right now, uh, it's finishing the setup and I have got only the Bluetooth symbol enabled here. Now you can see the network is going to pop up right here on the watch as well. Here you go, we've got Airtel plans set up successfully. Now you can call, text, and go online from your watch even when your phone's not with you. I'll tap on done. And it looks like the cellular services are active on the watch. Let's go ahead and check this out. Here we go. You can see the uh, network symbol is right here. This indicates that the cellular services are activated on the watch. That's all I want to share with you guys in this video. This is how you activate the LTE on your watch. And uh, uh, I will be posting some more videos on uh, the tips and tricks for the watch. And a full review on this watch is coming up very soon. So stay tuned for that. And we will also compare the Galaxy Watch 5 Pro with the Galaxy Watch 6 Classic. And uh, we are going to see what are the differences, you know, how good this watch is compared to the Watch uh, 5 Pro and whether it makes sense to upgrade from this watch to the Galaxy Watch 6 Classic or not. Uh, I'm going to share all those details in the next video. So stay tuned and stay subscribed. That's about it. Thanks for watching. You guys take care and stay safe. I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye-bye.